Thanks, and the weather looks to be absolutely beautiful for grilling out over the long holiday weekend too, but as we know, like everything else, it's gonna cost you more. I don't see you on the grill. Really? Yeah. No, I'm a great griller. Really? You know, yeah, I flip burgers. Not sure I believe that. Oh, WVTM 13's Chip Scarborough live in Homewood to break down what shoppers should expect at the grocery store. Chip. Guy and Brittany, unfortunately, pretty much everything you buy at the grocery store this holiday weekend is going to cost you more. That includes all the meats that you like to pick up and bring out here to the park and throw on the grill. The meat section at the Piggly Wiggly in Homewood is well stocked for Memorial Day weekend, filled with items people will be looking to grill for their holiday weekend gatherings. But shoppers first have to digest the sticker shock. Not to the point where I'm going to not eat what I want to eat because I don't have a lot of luxuries in life, so I don't like it, but I just go with it. I try to be a little bit conscious about where I shop, but I also am loyal to the, the stores that always have you know the products that, that we've always enjoyed. Experts say on average, items at the grocery store are costing shoppers 10 to 20% more than this time last year, especially meats, dairy products, and items with grains like bread. Some of that can be attributed to higher gas prices. And so nearly everything you have to buy at the grocery store has to be driven or processed somehow, which involves energy. There are other factors like higher production costs, for instance, more expensive feed for livestock. There's also the labor shortage, fewer workers resulting in higher prices. That there's just simply higher costs to attract enough people to provide the labor, to provide all the food that you want to have. Shoppers say they're fully aware they'll likely be dealing with more of the same for quite some time. It hurt the pocketbook, but I'm ready. <laughs> but what can we do? We just have to go with it. It's, it's crazy how much more things are right now. And experts say, unfortunately, there is not a quick fix to this. In fact, they say things could actually get worse before they get better. Let's hope not. Live in Homewood, Chip Scarborough, WBTM 13.